watching Force 13 Live. Hello and welcome, this is Force 13 Live with myself Nathan Foy and all the Skype team that we have every time here on Force 13 Hi. Live. Hi! Hello, lots of noise. Where is everyone? <laughs> Hi. Hello Nathan, how uh, are you? me, hello. Um, and the Skype team you can see somewhere, oh there, there they are. <laughs> it's all messed up isn't it? Um, I'll have to change those numbers that you see on the screen in a moment because that's no longer the case anymore but we'll be talking storms and as you can see that's sort of what the agenda is right now. Hurricane Jimena, that wind speed is 120 miles an hour, not sure on the pressure just now. Ignacio down to 75 miles an hour, again not so sure on the pressure just yet but I'll find out that very momentarily. This live show has sort of been slightly slow of the moment but um but hey we made it and uh we're going to be talking storms for the next hour and we're going to be taking your comments questions and anything else that uh you'd like us to pick up on during the show and we may do some guess the storm as well excellent yeah that's the that's the only bit that you like either. <laughs> yeah uh, first of all daniel stop shuffling around <laughs> sorry <laughs> Uh, Ashley, let me just introduce everyone first. Daniel, hello. Hello. You're joining us from? Um, my living room. <laughs> I see. For some reason, I'm looking extremely red on the uh, camera right now. I don't know why that's happening. I've, I've not been... I I'm not in an oven. Um, Marcel, hello. Hi. Joining us Feels from... Like an oven. From Colombia. <coughs> Where there's been no storm since Hurricane Joan, probably. Um, Justin, hello. Hi. Thanks for joining us this evening. And Caesar. Hello, people. From Monterrey, Mexico. Uh, famous yes. for seeing Hurricane Alex. Yes, that's right. Fantastic. And I'm, I, I'm so pleasure to be here with oh. us. Uh, so, let's get started. It's excellent to have you as well. Uh, okay, well. Do you want to join us to begin by talking about Hurricane Fred, or Tropical Storm Fred as it is now, because it has weakened. It's now only a tropical storm in the Atlantic, with winds of, what was it, 60 miles an hour? No, down to 50 now. 50 miles now, you can see it on my screen, guys. 50 miles per hour, and uh, the pressure, what's the pressure on that? I'm not familiar with the pressures at the moment, but let me just find out for you. The pressure on Fred is... 1,003. 1,003 millibars. Um, and 50 miles an hour. The Eastern Pacific storms, well, in fact, the big ones are no longer in the East Pacific. The only thing that is right now is this thing, uh, which you can see on your screen right now in the visible imagery. This is Tropical Depression 14E, which has formed in the last uh, few hours in the Eastern Pacific. Caesar, what do you think of that? Well, uh, it will strengthen uh, uh, as a tropical storm Kevin in the next hours, and and in the forecast it says that will dissipate before strike back at California. Yes. Now, um, uh, I guess you know a little bit about what things are like there, um, Caesar, because you're in Mexico. Um, did uh, I guess the last big landfall there was El Deal, wasn't it? And um, I'm just intrigued, really. How, how how were things there after Odile? Well, uh, after Odile, uh, se several people uh, were homeless uh, without electricity and without uh, potable water. The damage was very extensive. Uh, uh, One point two billion of dollars in damage. Uh, some people died, uh, but. Well, Baja California is okay right now, and it's fully recovered for that storm. Well, that's good news. Uh, um, Daniel? When was the deal? Uh, that was yeah. back in, was it September or perhaps October 2014? Oh, we, was Caesar affected by it, or did I miss that bit? No, no. Caesar, what no. was the last storm you were directly affected by? Was it, would it be it, Alex? 
It was Alex, wow. yes. So it's been a while for you, hasn't it? Because of the dead Atlantic. <laughs> yes. <laughs> 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 okay, well, uh, that, that there's 14E, which could become Kevin very soon. Uh, this is Hemena right now, I think. Yes, that's Hemena that you're looking at here. And it's been looking good the whole time. The GFS model has been predicting this storm to stay strong for a hell of a long time. Um, and perhaps that is coming to fruition. It is only 120 miles now, trying to get its act together once again, uh, possibly to reach the giddy heights of 150 miles an hour that it managed twice before now. Uh, do you think it will do it, guys? No, uh, Kimena will be will be, uh, <laughs> will weaken in the next hours, and probably in the next three days is it will be dissipating. Oh, well, that's a disappointment. We'll check yes. the models out. We'll check the models <laughs> out later on. By the way, um, I'm just trying to um, let people know that we're live. Uh, Jimena, it will turn to northwest. Uh, yeah. And accelerating, so it will be a fast weakening. And pressures now 955 millibars, 120 miles per hour currently. Yep, and uh, let's move on to uh, Ignacio, which another one that Hawaii has successfully dodged. Uh, there it is there. Um, it's getting that look, isn't it, when storms just getting a bit too far north and being sheared to bits as well, probably. Yes. Um, yes, it's weakening too, very fast. 100 and 985 millibars, 75 miles per hour of wind speeds. Okay, very good. Um, and uh, obviously no warnings in effect for Hawaii anymore because it is pulling away. Uh, Himena, I suspect, will not be a problem for Hawaii either, but you can never be too careful. Uh, finally, this is Kilo, which has stayed you know, pretty much stationary since it, um, and it's just about... Uh, edged over the international dateline uh, and is now Typhoon, Typhoon Kilo. Do you think it will become a 193 mile an hour Category 5 season? <laughs> oh my god, I don't think so. Uh, it it should be possible. I, it, it's That's not real. what one of the models said uh, this morning, yesterday. Hey, Kilo, will, <laughs> Kilo will not equal uh, Typhoon's tip strength. <laughs> It will be nearly impossible. Nearly. Yes. <laughs> you, you, so you're leaving yourself open there for possible, um, you know, corrections <laughs> if it does. <laughs> hey. Yes. That that models. I don't know what's happening with that models. Is. I don't know if, if that models are playing with stones or something. It's, it's incredible that it predicts that. No good. Okay, uh, well, that's that. Uh, so that's all the storms. Uh, we'll let you know any information on those storms that comes in. Let me just get those pressures right. Um, so the pressure on Ignacio, you said, was 985. What was Jimena? Uh, 955. 955. So they've gone up, obviously, because those storms are weakening. Uh, elsewhere around the world, I don't think there is anything else going on, but I'm just going to check to see if there are any new developments on the uh, ATCF file, which you could just see briefly there. Uh, <clears throat> well, um... nope, nothing new. Uh, just that Kilo has weakened, actually. Uh, uh, well, that was earlier on. That is down to, just uh, those who may not know, 105 miles an hour loss of major hurricane status. Daniel? Wasn't there something <clears throat> going on in the uh, Western Pacific? Well, only that Kilo has entered the Western Pacific. Oh. Hmm. All right. And that's been very recent. Uh, elsewhere, uh, can we get Himawari imagery, perhaps? Just trying to find... Uh, yes, we can. Here's the latest Himawari image of the uh, Western Pacific. The Himawari imagery is fantastic, by the way, isn't it, guys? Yes, very, very impressive. Crazy impressive. Uh, Daniel? Yeah? Do you fancy being useful today? <coughs> uh, yeah. Try and find some guest the storms for us. 
Um, this is I've got a uh, well. I don't know if that'll be possible. Oh, because I'm on a divisor. Oh, okay. so... disappointing. Maybe Justin yeah. can. Sorry. Just in time. I'm good. Yes. Ha ha ha. So, <laughs> there, there in the right in the background is Hermena, drawing ever closer to Hawaii. Further up, Ignacio. That's how it looks there. And then we have Kilo, which is really in the good quality view. Well, once it unpixelates itself. There it is. Very, Looking very nice. much the same as it did two days ago, to be honest. Storm that's not really doing any anything at the moment. Oh, God, here it comes. Um, moving <laughs> west, <laughs> for the rest of the West Pacific... Uh, we've got what was what was Invest 91W. They deactivated it, but it's starting to look better regardless than when it was an Invest. As it approaches the uh, the Mariana Islands, the southernmost island there being Guam. For the rest, a few isolated thunderstorms. Nothing really around the Philippine area and elsewhere in the West Pacific. It's looking rather quiet right now. Uh, there's a big burst down here that could possibly de be uh, designated as an invest soon if that continues to flare up because that's looking pretty good um, and a little thunderstorm down here in the southern hemisphere which we may possibly be watching for development very soon because the models have been saying stuff like that recently I'm just going to pitch myself up a little bit hello um, <laughs> so that that's the current situation on this side of the globe it's the most beautiful part of the globe because the best imagery, <laughs> um, but quite possibly the most deadly as well. Yes. Mm. No good. <laughs> no. Uh, <laughs> no. 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 Of course, good. no news. Uh, well, Fred passed through the Cape Verde Islands. It's now well away. Uh, Fred um. won't be doing anything. Just need to point out as well. Uh, zero, near zero percent chance of what's left of Erica, which is currently over Florida right now. Nothing's going to happen out of that, surely. Zero percent. Obviously. <laughs> okay, well, uh, let's take a look at the models, shall we? What a great place to go. <laughs> um, where is it? There it is. Uh, this is... Well, actually, before we look at the HWRF, we'll look at all of them in turn. Uh, so, the CMC, first of all, here's the latest CMC run, let's see what happens, because I've not seen this yet, uh, so, Caesar, are you looking forward to this, no? Yes. <laughs> uh, so there's Kevin, and Kevin moves north almost immediately after forming, and then a landfall, quite likely, yes, certain, on the Baja California Peninsula, and then into Mexico, uh, it, well, I, sh I almost said the mainland, but it's not really. Um, but, you know, the big chunk of Mexico. Um, well, yes. Fred continues as a tropical storm for a while. Quite long, actually. And what on earth is that in the Atlantic? Is that a tropical storm or extra tropical? Probably extra tropical, but it's pretty impressive. Near Madeira. That's very interesting. It could possibly be tropical in nature, but I'm not going to speculate too much. Tropical storm forming down here near the Cape Verde Islands, sort of in the position that Fred was, but I think that was moving further west, yes. And Jimena, you could see on the screen there, very strong, and then gradual weakening as it stalls and then turns north and then turns west and heads towards Hawaii, probably only a cat one or two at this point at the last frame. And a big low pressure system in the Atlantic near Bermuda as well at the end of day eight. <clears throat> The ECMWF is next. It predicts the following. Jimena staying strong. Kevin not so strong, weakening and dissipating off the coast of the Valley of California Peninsula. That's pretty much what the NHC said. A very weak and tiny system here. That's barely a tropical depression. Possible tropical storm up here, but gets sucked away to the north very quickly, so it's difficult to tell. A strong extratropical cyclone approaching France and the UK uh, after 10 days, and another East Pacific storm, but that is a, quite a far uh, way out. The GFDL model, 
um, predicts many things. Uh, the 18 Zulu on 14E, let's take a look at that first and foremost, probably the most interesting one we'll be looking at, but then again, it predicts nothing. Barely a tropical storm and a very short-lived one at that. It does predict Jimena to turn towards the north and then towards the west as we saw in a similar fashion on the GFS, or no, sorry, the CMC model we saw earlier. Um, I don't think we need to look at Jimena in that case. Uh, let's look at what it says for Fred. Probably not much, but let's just take a look. Um, oh, it does predict 62 knots there, so heading towards hurricane status as it moves towards the northwest. A small storm turning to the east and then redeveloping again by the looks of things there and being a tropical storm by the end of six days. Briefly weakened to a tropical depression, then re-strengthens. That's interesting. Latest GFS model is rather recent. I've not seen this one before either. Uh, keeping Hemena very strong and perhaps, yes, definitely strengthening there. Really strong at that point. Possibly a high-end Cat 4 there. Let's run that through again. Because I had to, basically. Uh, Kevin remains extremely weak, even if it does get named, which seems rather unlikely if you look at these models, but I think it will. Um, and by the end of 180 hours, Fred's long gone. Possible Grace down there in the deep tropics, but I don't think so. Um, Fred lost itself around four days, day five perhaps, maybe just about reaching day six. And then there's that low pressure system again near Bermuda. Don't know if that's tropical or not. Could be something to watch out for, particularly in Bermuda, but probably nowhere else, in all honesty. We'll leave out the HWRF because I'll show you the swathe... Um, visualizations in a moment on that one. The nav gem finally um, takes Kevin into the into the peninsula, the Bay of California Peninsula in Mexico, very strong, well rather strong, hurricane force at least. That's on day four. Jimena remains very strong. Fred keeps going and gets sucked to the north by that really broad low pressure system. That's far too broad to be a tropical cyclone. And then you've got um, this system here a uh, possible new system near the Cape Verde Islands on day six. So let's go back to the HWRF. First of all for Fred. And as you can see, not predicting much for Fred. Um, secondary peak of 72 miles per hour, just shy of hurricane status in around two days or so, and then gradual weakening from there. Um, it does actually have Kevin here even though the NHC haven't officially named it yet, unless something has happened that I don't know about. But uh, it does say Kevin. Uh, but no, I can't confirm that we do have Kevin right now, because uh, the NHC aren't saying that we do. Um, but there we are. Um, predicting a weak tropical storm, well, 50 miles an hour, staying well away from land. Jimena, HWRF predicts, yep, weakening from here on in. As it moves towards the north, we'll keep hold of hurricane intensity for quite a while, but on around day five or maybe day six, it will lose hurricane intensity. Ignacio is on its way out. That's pretty much a foregone conclusion. Gradual northwestward movement and then towards the north and really expanding its wind field as they do when they turn post tropical and extra tropical. Uh, Kilo, perhaps the most interesting one to watch out for very soon. Look at that. Very broad area of Category 4 winds and just short of Category 5 status there in the next five days. Huge wind feel by the looks of it, unless it's really zoomed in. I don't think it is, though. Um, really? With high wind speeds of 155 miles per hour, which, of course, is just short of Category 5 status. Don't know what you think of that, Caesar. Huge amounts of rain where it was expected to storm very soon. A lot. Mm. Blow me away, literally. <laughs> okay, uh, <clears throat> well, at this point, let's take some questions because there are one or two. Um, Chocolate Bunny says, Is any hurricanes <laughs> forming? The answer is pretty much no. <clears throat> apart from what might become Kevin. Um, also says, why can't Fred hit Florida? Why? <laughs> it's, uh, it's, it's too, too far, far chocolate. It, it's not going. It's not going anywhere near, unfortunately, for Florida or for a chocolate bunny. <laughs> Just a chocolate bunny cat. And now it says, Killer looks like a peanut. 
Oh. Do, do you think, Daniel? Uh, you seem to be an expert with peanuts. Does Kilo uh, look like a peanut? He, I don't know. I can't see it. <laughs> oh, for God's sake! And I thought he said something else, and I thought, um, oh, never mind. No, no. Someone who can see it. Does Kilo look like a peanut right now on your screen? Have we been reduced to this, really? <laughs> Okay, no takers. Let's move on. Uh, let's I'll look you up. To the, you're looking up. To the show yeah. maps right now. Um, tell you what, if a storm decides it wants to form in the West Pacific, look at it. No wind shear for a whole wide area of the West Pacific. If what's left of 91W ends up in this area, which is highly likely, it's going to have a field day. Look at that. I've got to check the dry air very soon, though, just in case. Uh, there you can see Kilo so far east that it's on the scale right now. Uh, that is the true position of Kilo in relation to the map. It's way off the chart. Um, and low wind shear ahead, so I don't see any reason why it can't intensify, at least gradually, though it is, de it is increasing slightly ahead of the storm. Moving to the EPAC, the East Pacific. Ignacio having a hell of a time with wind shear on its way out, definitely. Oh my god, a lot. Emena will follow suit sooner or later, probably later though. Day um, three or four, maybe. Um, TD 14 too. Yeah, it even, it even shows it as a tropical storm on here as well, um, with very high wind shear to the north, so I'm not sure what the nav gem is doing because I don't see a strong landfall even a weak landfall on the Bay of California Peninsula. I'm on about no landfall, and the storm won't make it that far. That's what it looks um, like to me Nathan, at the moment. Yeah? I can confirm that um, Kilo does not look like a peanut. <laughs> <laughs> it might look like um, a Go peanut on. without the shell, because... But that's oh, down to interpretation. Okay. Doesn't like one to me. Right. <clears throat> um, looking at the Atlantic. Yeah, let's move off that quickly. The Atlantic. Fred is battling wind shear as well. Moderate amounts at the moment. It will increase if it moves north or if it moves far enough west. So for that reason, there's no future for Fred in the long run. Poor Fred. The Indian Ocean, no data. Go back three hours. Oh, goodness. No wonder we've not seen any Indian Ocean storms this year. Look oh, at no. that. <laughs> it's a bloodbath. A tropical storm bloodbath. <laughs> Where's uh, Jason? That I have no idea. He's... Oh, he's usually on at this time. He is, actually, isn't he? Maybe he's just decided yeah. to sleep in. You yeah. know, anyone can do that. I think Kilo is the only hurricane, is the only typhoon too, that can reach Category 5. The only top system in the world that can reach Category 5. Can or can't? Can. 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 Yes. So Kilo will reach Cat 5, you think? Yeah. Okay. Isn't Kilo meant to be stronger than Typhoon Tip? N well. One of the models. <laughs> right, let, let, let me show this you... This is the best joke I ever heard. There's the water vapor, by the way. Looking good in the West Pacific right now, even though there's no storms. Right, let, let me show you something, everyone watching. You'll be baffled by this. The prediction for Kilo back at midnight UTC on September the 1st. So it was over a day ago that this was predicted. And it predicted this. Kilo has weakened since this happened. There's Cat 4, there's Cat 5, 165 miles an hour, slight weakening, and then it's back to Cat 5 again, and now 909 millibars, 175 miles an hour, stronger, 903, 900, 893, 888, with winds of 182 oh miles per hour, my. 881, oh. with winds of 100 and, um, 186 miles an hour, 878 with winds of 187, 188 miles an hour. Oh 872.7 nice. 
with winds of 193 miles per hour sustained. If if you make oh this, is, it, it will be the second, the second, the second, the second tropical system, the second most intense tropical system in the world. But I can in tell you, story. there's a 99% chance that that will not happen. Yeah. <laughs> uh, this looks oh. like Ipo world, to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 190 oh. plus. Oh, so good lord. Yeah, <laughs> terrible. Martinez Julian says the Indian Ocean is like the Atlantic. They are both dead. Uh, Ram Turtle <laughs> says, Goodbye, Fred. You did nothing worth a point in the Atlantic. <laughs> um, here's the uh, Eastern Pacific water vapor imagery right now. You can see that uh, Ignacio is also battling dry air on almost all sides. Jimena is looking decent. And what could be Kevin very soon? A little bit of dry air on the left-hand side of it, so um, we'll watch and wait on that one. But I don't hold out much hope for Kevin. North Atlantic, another graveyard, dry air environment surrounding Fred. Uh, well, look at that. That's what positives can you take out of that? <laughs> that it's not affecting land. But the, apart from Fred, the Atlantic is an absolute graveyard. There it is. Uh, the Indian Ocean, for any interest there, uh, does show an interesting system near the uh, near the uh, near Bangladesh in the northern Bay of Bengal. Um, usual tropical thunderstorms occurring in the South Indian Ocean, not too far from Diego Garcia. Um, but apart from that, it's diddly squat down there. Uh, in a moment, I want to try and get up the latest model ones for the West Pacific. If it, if there's any there. No, not that. <coughs> um somewhere on here Let, let's see let's see if uh, these generate mod i i i need, need to go not found uh, uh well goodbye marcel he didn't even wait for us to say goodbye bye marcel see bye. if the cmc had anything up for the west pacific area and the south pacific no no models there at the moment at least not on this website oh there's a nav gem the nav gems there actually predicting key look at that Predicting Kilo to hover on the international dateline, stall right over it, and then head back and hover right on the line for the next three days, and then gradually turn west and look at the bombing out of it there as it moves towards the west on day five and six. That could be a cat five there on day six. Long range threat to Japan, perhaps? Too early to tell, uh, but with that high pressure to the north, could be possible. <clears throat> but I do doubt it. I do doubt it. Um, Certainly no threat to the Philippines, as one person asked me earlier today. No threat there. Um, yes? I might um, get going soon. No! I'm, I'm, no! I'm tired. No, no. Don't be silly. <laughs> I'm knackered. Well, that's nothing new. I'm fine of dozing off. It doesn't take much. <laughs> I might get myself a cup of hot chocolate or something. Oh, that, that would be nice. I wish I yeah. had a cup of cho hot chocolate right now. Um, okay, uh, let me just uh, reiterate what the current intensities and everything is on the storms right now. So, Hurricane Ignacio, currently with winds of 75 miles an hour. And 985 millibars. That's what you're looking at on your screen right now. That's Ignacio there, moving north of Hawaii. As far as I know, there are no warnings in effect for Hawaii anymore. There certainly shouldn't be. Expected to move towards the northwest. No warnings in effect. That's confirmed. Hurricane Jimena. That's further east and the most impressive looking storm right now, even though it's weakened. Pressure's 120. Uh, sorry. Wind speed 120 miles an hour, <laughs> pressure 955. No problems for Hawaii from Jimena as far as I know. 
Yep, likely to curve well away from the islands. So no problems there. Kilo, right now, currently has winds of 105 miles an hour and a pressure of 956 millibars. We've also got Tropical Depression 14E, which as far as we know has still not become Kevin yet. Um, with winds of 35 miles per hour and a pressure of 1006 millibars and is likely to move towards the north but the NHC they're not keen on it affecting the coast of Mexico very much only one or two models are to be fair and we just saw the wind shear is huge north of the storm so that's going to have to go first um, in the Atlantic of course we have tropical storm Fred with the winds now only 50 miles an hour and a pressure of 1003 weakening trend uh, but it has stayed the same in the last six hours and is slowly expected to move towards the west northwest and weaken back to the team anything that you'd like to pick up on right now guys that's going to keep weakening because the water temperature in the northern atlantic is also cold Yes, that's something we've not looked at, actually. Take a look, then. <laughs> Indeed, the well, SSPs. The sea surface temperatures. What are they? Let's find out. Uh, looking first at the Eastern Pacific. Water temperature's very warm. Even where our show is right now, water temperatures are warm enough, but it's just that dry air and wind shear that's killing it. Um, water temperatures are actually warm enough for Fred right now as well, albeit barely, around 26 to 27 degrees where Fred is right now. Uh, Jimena, right. by the way, looking decent um, in water temperatures of around 28 degrees, maybe slightly less now. For the east we've got, of course, TD14E, which is in very warm waters, that is one thing that's really going for it. The rest of the Atlantic, there's a big 30 degree swathe moving out over the central Atlantic right now so you know we could see it's a good spot for a major I have to say this area here around um, due north of the Lesser Antilles that 30 degree splodge uh, off the west coast of Florida right now is looking good as well 32 degrees in one local area just off the coast of uh, further south in Tampa I'm not sure where the area is it uh, Fort Myers area I think Max would tell me. Um, and I've got to say, look, warm water just off the coast of Africa as well, so if something was following Fred, it would have a little bit of um, fuel there. Look at the very warm temperatures. I am not. I don't know what the name is. Uh, the Gulf there. Off the coast of Saudi Arabia. Really warm waters there, though. Very cold off the coast of, um, of Oman right now. For some reason and Somalia as well the rest of the Indian Ocean very warm it's probably something to do with El Nino actually uh, the North, North Indian very warm around 28 degrees but we saw that wind shear map terrible conditions for wind shear right now in the Indian Ocean so yeah I don't think we'll see anything there for quite some time uh, unless it formed way to the north near the coast of Bangladesh that is West Pacific right now looking rather good in the north of the South China Sea, in particular 30 degree temperatures. Plus also this whole area east of the Philippines extending over Invest 91W and beyond to Kilo. And um, Kilo is in the best part of the Pacific right now. 30 degree temperatures very, very abundant around Kilo. And that's going to remain the case for about five days or so, I think. Unless it's further north than I thought it was. It might be actually. Uh, but still, if if it's uh, no further north than Japan is, then it's looking decent. Should get back that imagery of, uh, of where Kilo is right now, actually. Uh, yeah, so it's looking fine. Um, not as far south as I thought it was, but still not as north as it could be. So looking decent for Kilo. And some of the models do predict it will dip towards the south as well in the next few days. So... Good chances of intensification in the next few days for Kilo, though it might not. Uh, so, Caesar, what would you like to tell us? Well, I only can say that 
It's a lie. Oh, what? That kilo. <laughs> What's a lie? That kilo will be a 872 millibar typhoon and 193 mil, uh, miles per hour winds. <laughs> oh my yeah, god. Well, well, we get it. We get it. <laughs> Sorry, but I can't believe it. I can't. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I well... can't imagine that. Sorry. <laughs> okay, fine. All right. Calm down. Well, uh... Yes, I need to calm down. <laughs> We're going to take a break now because uh, I think we've discussed everything that's going on. It's pretty boring, really, when there's no warnings in effect. Um, unless we're on for like three hours with lots of people and other people talking. Um, but there we are. Uh, we'll be back in a few moments' time to play Guess the Storm and most other things. We'll see you in a few moments. See ya, guys. Hi. Oh, you're a bit late. <laughs> no, no. We're, we're, we're just, uh, we're just um, doing... What we're doing? I've forgotten what we're doing now. <laughs> We're, we're, we're taking a short break whilst we get some guests of um, ready. Yeah. Okay? Is that okay. good for you? Yeah. Excellent. Fantastic. What about chocolate bunny? Welcome back, this is Force 13, we're live on air, Force 13 Live, that's the name, hey, it works. And we're back looking at the floater of K-1. 
Kilo right now. That's what Kilo looks like. Um, my name is Nathan Foy, if you've just joined us. I'm joined by the team, Daniel, Justin and Caesar. A small team this evening. <coughs> yeah. Welcome back, people. Yeah. Hello. Welcome back. Yeah. Uh, well, uh, we're, we're going to play Guess the Storm next, and uh, my Guess uh, the Storm is all, almost ready. Um, uh, yes. A little bit of play. You've got what? I can't play. You can't play. At least I can't see the stream. Oh, well, that's a shame. <laughs> yeah, oh well. So it's a crying shame, Danny. Yeah, I think I'd cry. Yeah, me too. <laughs> Sorry. Caesar, would you cry? No. Oh, well that's, that's interesting. I will not cry. I am sad now. I am crying cry now. now. Hi, Max. Well, hello. Hi. Hello. What, what's going on, Max? Welcome. Um, welcome. You're in Florida. Yeah. Any thunderstorms today? Yeah. Um, Have you got the television on? Oh my God! <laughs> <laughs> I, let me turn down the, <laughs> the it, microphone. It was, it was rain, but no floods at the moment. Rain, but no floods. Well, that sounds promising. Yeah. Good. <laughs> um, okay, well, hey, time to play. Guess the storm. Here it comes. I missed the live stream. What the hell is this? Is the question. Um, I don't see anything. Oh. <laughs> Not such a thinky of it in my uh, in my head. Yeah, you're thinking of it in your head. It looks like a storm. Yeah. Okay. It's a storm. <laughs> it is a storm, believe it or not, yeah. Well, I think we sort of figured that one out. Does it have an eye? Uh, does it, Caesar? I'll let you tell him. Um, oh my god, I don't know. <laughs> what do you mean you don't know? I need to know. Um... Okay, well... Uh, oh, uh, Hank asked me a question. Is Kilo Typhoon yet? Um, I haven't been online today. Yes, it is. It is a Typhoon. Run Turtle says that it's Kilo. No, it's not Kilo, nor does it weigh a Kilo. That's Kilo. <laughs> <laughs> That's Kilo. I've got a question. Yeah. Has anybody ever tried to weigh a hurricane? Um, I... Uh, there was a fact, there was a stat at one point that a hurricane weighed, I can't remember what it was, it, several thousand elephants. <laughs> or it might have been millions, what if, I don't know. What would do with all the moisture and the rain and. Right. Uh, Hank says that it's Ignatio. Yeah, I guess it's coming in for Loki and Ignatio. It is neither. Nope. nope. So. I think it's Hurricane Paul. It's Hurricane what? Paul. Paul? Yes. Oh, we had that one yesterday. Paul? Yeah. Maybe it's a... Oh, Paul. Maybe... <laughs> Hurricane maybe it's... Paul. Test your ears <laughs> out. What about Pat? No. Okay. Certainly not. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Hurricane Darby. No, no Darby. Uh, what about Chris, Christopher? Ram Turtle says looks like Sea Pack, Central Pacific. I think it's Iniki. It's certainly not Iniki. Mm. What were you thinking? <laughs> this guy doesn't think. <laughs> <laughs> um, is 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 who's, it's who's tricking doing Ken <laughs> Is Kenneth? No, it's not Kenneth. Uh, Celia. Not Celia. Uh, Ram says hello, Rachel. Not Halola. <laughs> nice spelling. Halola. <laughs> oh, Hal 
It's like Hal and then Ola on the end. Oh, look. <laughs> no, oh, you're getting all confused now. <laughs> no, um. Numpty Nuts. Ah. Uh, <laughs> Hurricane FIFA. No. Ma uh, good, good guess, actually. Max, do you have any idea what this is? No. Um. What the hell is this? Hank says Julio. Julio, good guess. It is not Julio. Um, I'm trying to think of a clue for, at the moment, but I'm struggling. <laughs> Oh my god, I And Danny? No. No. Nope. Martinez, Martinez says. says Steve. Steve. It's not Steve. Um, There's no Steve. Typhoon. Typhoon 2. Uh, oh my god, grow up. No, you. Uh, no, you. Oh, don't do no. it. <laughs> oh, um, is Typhoon Morakot? Not Mor. <laughs> <laughs> Not. <laughs> careful. I'm very careful. Don't worry. Excellent. Oh, Katarina. Well, Katarina. Terrible. Is Rina. I'm actually working on some clues for you guys, so hang tight. <laughs> Karina, Hurricane. Did you say? Hurricane Rina. Rina, sorry. Oh, not Rina. Um, okay, uh, I'll so tell you. Is Hurricane <laughs> Philip? This is a Northern Hemisphere storm, and it's not Philippe. <laughs> Daniel, what's so funny? <laughs> Nothing. Yeah, something is. Nothing. Daniel, come on. Okay. Yes. Okay. Get out. Get. And some clues. Some clues, Nathan. <laughs> right, I'm getting there. I'm getting there. He's <laughs> booting up the PC. <laughs> no way. How is that possible? <laughs> Mr. Toshokan Alpha says it's Fred. No, good guess. It's not Fred. Typhoon Jaggy uh, from Ram Turtle. No, it's not Jaggy oh. Ram. Martinez is Roslyn. No. Oh deal. No. It's not O deal. Oh. It's Norbert. Yeah, I'm gonna finish it after my lights. So. No. Wherever this is, I don't know if anyone knows where this is yet, but um. It was a below average season, wherever it was. It was a below average season hurricane. It was or not typhoon. in this century. It was in the last century. Last and century. I'll go. No, I won't go one step further just yet. Um, it is a female name, though. A female name in the last century and in. The, in uh, 20th century. In, in, okay. in a below average season. Below average season, okay. Yes. Ro Rosa. And his female name, okay. Okay. So no other guesses maybe... have been correct yet. Please, Helen. somebody. Oh, oh my Helen. god. Max? Hurricane Helen. No, no Helen. Um, oh, no it's, hurri it's Hurricane Chris. No, it's not. Ah, it's not a female. It's not a female. <laughs> Sorry, Chris. It's, it's it was Florence. No, it's not Florence. Oh. This storm name has been used in the last three years. In the in the last three years. Oh my God. Sorry, that's well, actually incorrect. So well, I well, need man. to know. I'm at five. Last five years. Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! Wonder. Wonder. Wanda, my God! Hank says Bonnie. It was Erin. The Shokan Alpha says Rose. Martinez says Cosme. Erin says Chant. Caesar says Erin. Dolliver eighty two says Daniela. Ram Turtle says Chantal. None of these are correct. Faye. Nope. It's not Faye. Uh, Hannah. Not Hannah. Uh, uh, Dolly. Not Dolly. I see you're thinking Bert. all Atlantic names at the moment. Bertha. Flossy. Not no Bertha, no Flossy. Oh my God, Jesus <laughs> no Christ! This storm is in the Atlantic. <laughs> not is it? This Amy. storm was used in the 1980s. Well, this storm, Amy. this storm is pictured. No. Um. Deborah. Bur burial. No. More guesses coming in. None of them are correct. No. So what did you Deb say, Caesar? 
Debbie. <laughs> no, before them. Oh my Jesus Christ! Oh jeez, I don't ah. know Helene. Helene. I I Deborah. always said, no. I always said Helen. I I just I just said no for no reason, and I wasn't actually listening to what you said before Caesar. So whatever that guess was, <laughs> okay. I don't know whether that's right it's or wrong. It's Hurricane Arlene. No, Dolores. <laughs> Dolores. Cindy. None of these. Not Cindy. Not Dean. Uh, Emily. Rebecca. Not Rebecca. Not Emily. Oh my goodness. Oh my I'm god. I'm to say it's Barry. Danny. Oh, not Barry. It's Danielle. No, not Danielle. Oh. I don't know. Nathan. Bo Bonnie. No, I just am a bit concerned, Caesar, because one of those <laughs> guesses that you can't remember might oh. just be the correct answer. I, I didn't hear it when when one ear. Is that the Beryl? Other. Grace. Beryl. Beryl. Yeah, that's what he said. Is it? Earlier. Caesar, did you say Beryl? Yes. Well, guess what? What? Guess what? It's correct. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. <laughs> it's the correct answer. <laughs> Excellent! <laughs> Barrel, got it, 1982. Oh, I go to bed soon. And you can see the Cape Verde Islands on the right hand side, so rather similar to um, rather similar to Fred. Excellent. Who's having dinner? Max. We can hear you. <laughs> um, um, um. So tasty. We can hear um, you I... lunch. Oh no. What? What's wrong, Dan? Nearly, nearly as bad as Michael. Yeah, Michael's worse. Like then. eating his breakfast. Oh, uh, I might get going soon. I'm sorry. All right then. Have a good well, night. How? No. How long is this going on for? Uh, we're going on. We're only going on for a few more minutes, actually. All right. I might stay then. You'll stay. Yeah. You sure? Until it finishes, yeah. You sure you want to stay? Yeah. Okay. Okay, nice. Uh, yes. Here's the next Guest of Storm. What the hell is this? <laughs> what the hell is this? <laughs> oh, uh, it's. is is is. Oh, oh my god, I remember the, the, that <laughs> photo. Oh, no. <laughs> I can't see anything. Good question, by the way. What the hell is this? Uh, I'm going to oh, give you the opportunity my. to ask me. Uh, a yes no question. Lo looks like a typhoon. Mm. You can ask me a yes no question and I'll answer it okay. truthfully. Okay, it's a typhoon? Is that a question? Yes. Yes, it's a typhoon. Excellent. I knew it. Um, looks like it's in the 90s or 80s or so. Is it in the Northern Hemisphere? <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> okay, I can't even see it. So. Yes, that's fair enough. He can't see it. Hi, John. Hello. Good evening, John. Good evening. I am really busy right now. I am swapped. But Crazy. I'm going to talk. I've only got one am... question for you, John. <laughs> what the hell is this? <laughs> um, I'm on my phone. I can't see anything. Oh, I see. Um, John, is Typhoon call. Roy? No, it's not Roy. Um, but I am. I am going to be. I am going to be listening to this call. But if you guys can, it's Typhoon I Doyle. It. My guys, mind posting the image. Gosh, John, you're cutting in and out really badly. Hank says Susan. Typhoon Gay. No, it's not. It's, it's not Doyle. Susan. It's not Doyle. It's not Susan. Hal. It's not Hal. Typhoon Maleki. Maggie. Typhoon who? Lecky. No. Typhoon who? <laughs> Is it Typhoon who? No, it's not Typhoon who, and it's not Hurricane How. Is <laughs> Typhoon Ruby? Not Ruby. Mm. Uh, this typhoon occurred out at sea. It became a Category <laughs> 5. It was Mash. a Category 5. Yeah. It was a cat five. Lola. No. Pam. No. Peggy. No. Uh, this storm happened since 2000. In 2000? Ha since Hi 2000. Uh, since Hi 2000. No, not Haiyan. Martinez says flow. 
It's Typhoon. Uh, oh my god, I forgot. <laughs> it's not Typhoon. Oh my god, I forgot. Uh, <laughs> it's <laughs> Billis. Uh, not Billis. I'll take guesses again in a few seconds. It's Prapirun. Hello. Hello. It's Chan Chan. Hello. Hello. Yes, hello. Um, can you post it in the chat room so I can see it and make a guess at it? I can't. Someone else will have to. But actually, oh, Nathan. Jason? Jason's not here. Nathan. Uh, okay. <laughs> Just the, Nathan. Oh, is Dan Ray. What? You'll be able to see it on there. It's the bottom one we're looking at. Is Dan Ray. I've just sent you a private message. Um, no, no guesses have been correct so far. Um, other guesses from the viewers were Flo, Marge, and Sudalor. No, not Boris. Da Dan Ray. Um, Maysack? Not Maysack. What we know at the moment, John, a Category 5 Typhoon that has happened since 2000. So oh, God. My. So am I. Let me, let me, let me, let me check oh, no. my, let me turn on my computer, see if I can get on to nah, what's going on. Not Damray, not Saomai. This storm has occurred since 2005. Oh, oh God. Jesus uh, Christ. Uh, um, Maggie. Not Maggie. Hagapit. <laughs> Vong Vong. High time. High time. Long Wang. Long Wang. Not Long Wang. That's a good guess, actually. Long Wang was a Cat 5 in 05. Yeah. High time. Um, not High time. Not I, 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 I said, uh. It was mind. a Long Wang. Oh, Navi. Daniel. Not Navi. Let me, let me see that. Saola. Like, not Saola. Oh, God. Oh, this, this is probably a storm that lots of people forget about. Didn't affect land. Not really. Uh, okay, let's see. Is Jaggy? Bansy. No, no correct answers. Not uh. Hugo, not Bess, not Katrina. Mm. Aoki. Not Aoki. Good guess again. Aoki, I think, had a different structure. Yagi. Not Yagi. Uh, damn, is Cimarron? Still no one's got it yet. Other guesses, High Tang, Ping Pong, and Carl. <laughs> Ping Pong. <laughs> None of those. This storm I has don't... occurred since 2010. Oh, Jesus Christ. It's mm. Eagles. No. Matt? Oh. It's Eagle. No. no. It's Matt? Songda. No. Sheesh. No, whatever you said. It's Bofa. I think I'm. Oh. It's Typhoon Bofa. I can see it. I You're can see it now. Wearing specs. Yeah, these are, read these are reading glasses, by the way. I'm reading a chemistry textbook for taking notes cause before I, for my summer assignment, which is due tomorrow. Because yeah. it's my first day of school. It was AP chemistry. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. Nathan, it's uh, not Bofa. Um, no, other guesses. Kirugi not Bofa. Um, no. Oh god. It's Muifa. Um, no, not Muifa. Uh, Sudalor. Not Sudalor. Since 2010. Nan, a cat fire. Nan, 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 Nan Madol. No. Nan Madol. Uh, Samba? Oh. No. Oh! Sa Kaelin. <laughs> no. Kaelin. I said, I said Samba. Not I said Kaelin. No. It's not Samba? We're looking for the it's international it's name, it's by the way. The international Samba. name. It's Typhoon Samba. Samba. No, Samba. No, Samba. No, Samba. No. Dolphin. Not Dolphin. <laughs> Usagi. That is a good guess, you know, Daniel. It's not Dolphin. It's not Usagi. What? Oh, Jello what? Right. Not Jello. Oh, jeez. Jeez. Gee whiz, I didn't think it would take so long. This storm has occurred since 2012. No, Wait, my God! Uh, is, are we live? I'm a sir. It's Haiyan. Not Haiyan. Max, what? I was just there. Well, no one's got it right yet. Um, is this live? Right. Uh, is this live? Yes, it's live. <laughs> We're oh, live. Crap. <laughs> oh, God. Did you not know? I didn't, I didn't wear my hair nice. Oh, that's fine. Oh. I never wear my head. <laughs> it's Francisco. Correct. Uh, it's Francisco. No. Again. <laughs> oh my god. 2013. Uh, that's what we're looking at. That's what we're looking it's at. So that's good. Daniel's face. That is worth a face palm. Oh. Oh, dearie me. Two in a row. Oh my god. god. Caesar's got the two. 
Come on, viewers. Come on, viewers. I shared one of them with Caesar, though. Oh, my. Well, I shared with them. Max can't quite get over it, I think. Oh. Well, that's 20 points for the team, and the oh. viewers still haven't got off the board at all yet. <laughs> <laughs> this is the best episode of Guess the Storm, eh? <laughs> it's a zero. I, I've got no more Guess the Storm, so the next quiz, next thing is going to be what Let's we did last time. One. Let's We're, see what happens. Oh, well, if you've got one, then we'll go ahead with that instead of what I was going to do. Let me see if I can find one. Uh, don't, don't, open. Don't, don't try too hard. Alrighty, let's see what, what I got. What, I, what I was... What was, uh, Hurricane? Oh, shit, I don't have one. What are you talking um, about? What was it called? Francisco. Let me find one. Oh my god. <laughs> that was the last one, yeah. Alright, let, let me find one. Oh, oh, I think I got one. Oh my god. Uh, yes, Daniel? I have to kind of go now. Well, you have a good night. Okay. Oh my god. Good I night. Got I think I got one. Night knocks. Night. Oh my god. <laughs> um, John's got one. I'm trying to load it though. I'm trying to. I'm having trouble Doodles. with this. My internet's sucking. Oh dear. <laughs> that, that's not the great, not the greatest thing to do when when we're running short on time here. It's two minutes past. Okay. UTC, by the way, just to let you know what the information is whilst we've got a moment. Oh my what god. What you're looking at right now is uh, Hurricane Kilo, which has just passed the international dateline, is now Typhoon. Oh Kilo. my god. It's done an Ioki almost. Uh, not the strongest basing crosser, however. It's only a Cat 2 with winds of 105 miles per hour and a pressure of 9. Oh my god. 9, 56. 56. Yes. Well, God. Also looking at Ignacio, which is weakening rapidly off the coast of Hawaii. Well, north of Hawaii. Wind's now 75 miles an hour, pressure's 985. You're also looking at Jimena. Still the best looking storm, but has also weakened down to 120 miles an hour, Cat 3, with a pressure of 955. I'll be back in a minute, all right? Let me see okay. if I can try to load it. And this is Tropical Depression 14E, which could develop into Kevin very soon, though wind shear looks atrocious to the north of the storm. Baja California Peninsula should be watching the storm, but a landfall is a strong cyclone. Don't know what you think, Caesar, but I think it's unlikely. No, yeah, it will not be. Um, even, even a hurricane, it will, mm. it will dissipate in... Three, two days. Yep. That's Fred. 50 miles an hour, 1,003 millibars right now. Oh my gosh. I'm and uh, heading away from the Cape Verde Islands. John, take it away. As soon as I edit the image, I'll be ready. Oh crap. Oh, well, we'll, we'll, just, image. We'll, we'll just sit and wait. Uh, it'll take me less than a minute. <laughs> a minute is a long time in broadcasting, John. 30 seconds! <laughs> Dollover82 says, is there any hurricane going to hit Florida? The answer is, well, no. Well, uh, I mean, it depends what they mean. Is there ever going to be a hurricane hit Florida ever again? Probably. But is it going to be Fred? No. I mean, does, a Fred, does Fred have a chance of making it across the Atlantic? Oh, I doubt it. Fred's going to turn towards the north by day five. Just so going to be a fish storm? Yes, they often are when they, in this position, I mean, let, let me just get up the uh, climatological information on storms that have been in the area that Fred has been, just for some perspective here. I can guarantee you that nearly, if not all, storms will have moved towards the north in Fred's position, northwest of the Cape Verde Islands, and I'm just getting a little, um, just doing a quick uh, comparison here to other storms that are in its vicinity. And I can tell you that there are only... Uh oh. Here it comes! I oh, know, there's a few, sorry. Yeah, lots of storms. Um, the very weak ones remained as depressions, and one of them reached just north of the Lesser Antilles as a depression. The rest of them, tropical storm intensity or higher, moved well off to the north. All of them curved out to sea. There's about ten of them. All of them moved Excuse out to sea. My dog. A long way. And one of them... Uh, almost made landfall in France as a tropical storm. It had just turned post-tropical remarkably. Anyway, guess the storm. 
the question, what the hell is this? The answer, you've got to tell us. Um, what is that? Irene? Hey, what? Irene? What? George's. What? Um, oh. oh damn it! My my keyboard failed me. Oh what? Uh, Erica. No. No. Ninety-eight. Thanks. Ninety-eight. <laughs> Ninety-eight. <laughs> oh my fails. Um. Nope. Erica. Um, oh wait, it can't be like uh, that. Is oh my god. Uh, Sandy. Is tropical wave auto? <laughs> Danny, nice to meet you. Sandy, oh no, you can <laughs> just do that. Auto. Repeat that. O T T O. Auto. Oh, auto. Uh, auto. Sorry, this is they're not on autopilot right now. Oh my god. This is uh, uh, a conundrum. Is is Lenny? Oh, it could. No, it's too north to be Lenny. Mm. Um, Ophelia. Emily. Oh my god, um, Maria. Well, one question, do you notice the font? Do I what? Notice the font. <laughs> notice the what? The font. Ma the font. Ma oh, ma god. <laughs> oh. My teammate <laughs> said Lenny, it's certainly not. Major hurricane. It's evil. Oh yeah, you don't Arnold's say it's an Atlantic storm. <laughs> what the hell is this? <laughs> Alright, it's a is major. Da it's David. It's a major hurricane. It's it. uh. Oh. Okay. Yeah, it is not bad. That not a bad guess. Oh my God. Um. Hang on, I have to think. Edit. I have to think. Edit. Oh crap. Why? Why? Damn it. Um, Telling me Lenny was correct. No, it's not Lenny. I was gonna say something funny about it. It's Ike. Uh, yeah, Hank said Ike, but it isn't. It's not. Damn. Ike. Ike's way north of that. Katrina. Wrong way, Lenny. It's not Katrina. What? What planet are you on? A planet where it. Katrina hit Puerto Rico, yeah. <laughs> what else? People uh, say oh, I. Yeah, n certainly not. Um, well, this is a struggle, isn't it? Can you give us a hint? I thought Irene was a great guess. Isaac. No, it won't be Isaac. Oh Isaac my was, god. Isaac was further west. Double A. Ivan? Is Dean? No, Justin, it's not Ivan. Is Hurricane Dean? Is, how can that be Dean? Because it passed very close to Puerto Rico. <laughs> it wasn't that close. <laughs> well, <Office> no. Caesar. <laughs> I I need to I need to say something. <laughs> um, it's not a tropical storm something either. <laughs> it's a major hurricane. Well, was Isaac Bruce. a major? Was Isaac a major hurricane? Bruised Atlantic Bruce Canada. Canada. Rush, mm. sorry. Yeah, I know. Oh, yeah. Gosh. Um. Well, that doesn't really help me at all. Why? Right, because many storms do that? Yeah, I'm thinking... Because uh, I've done research on this recently. 
but I only looked at landfalls for Atlantic Canada, not close calls. Hank says, I have a feeling it's in 2004. Something tells me that as well, you know. Other guesses, Ernesto and Charlie. Neither of those, I don't think. Pre-2000. I'm thinking guys, 1990-ish. Yeah? Charlie so happened in a year after that. Right? Oh, four. It happened. Martin. No, it, it didn't. It didn't happen in 05. No, Cindy happened in 05. Martinez says Jane or Jean or. I don't know how uh, it's, it's called. Funny. Is. Is Dennis. Was used. Is Dennis. Once. Oh. Oh. Once the 30s. Uh, Klaus. Is Dennis. Oh, it's not gonna be Dennis. Uh, we, the... Give us more time, <laughs> no one knows you. Just let just just wait till we get the right answer. <laughs> Let's just wait. Hortons. Oh, it could be, you know. Is it? Yes! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I can't believe I got it. What is it? It's Caesar 3, the viewers nil, and the team what, what? really. <laughs> 3 in the world. Is... Caesar. What is it? What is it? Hortense. Holy that, that, was just, that name was used more than once. I thought it wasn't. I thought it was retired. It was used in 96, wasn't it? Oh. Oh my god. Oh, Hortense was retired. Oh, oops. <laughs> and I used to use more than once off. as well, Mr. Tashokan Alpha. Sorry, folks. <laughs> I'm only just space. Well, I don't think the viewers can argue with that, unfortunately. <laughs> that they still lost. Well, never mind. Um, Caesar's gonna rub it in your faces now. Don't complain to me. Um, <laughs> because I, I don't... I, I cannot be held responsible for what Caesar says, so... Um, if everyone's gonna walk out with a, uh, you know, torches you headed for his house in Monterey, Mexico, I'll tell you the address in private. Um, <laughs> if you t if you send a message to Fool Thirteen, I'll tell you the address, and the, uh, you can all go to see Caesar. Um, <laughs> you see the guest? Uh, yeah, someone just, it's not my room. fault. Don't come to Force Thirteen HQ. Thank you. Um, Nathan, yeah. you see this here? Tropical Storm X. X. <laughs> Because you said I want to say Tropical Storm or something. Yes, yes, indeed. Well, hey, uh, that's the end of my show. End of our show, even. Well, where did I get the mic from? It's not my show at all, it's ours. Uh, this was Force 13 Live. I was Nathan Foy, and we're going off air now. Uh, we'll see you again sometime soon. Not sure if it'll be tomorrow, but you know the usual time when we are on air. We'll try and post social media updates about it as soon as we know. This one came a little bit late, I do admit. Um, but next time, uh, it'll probably be around 11 p.m. UTC, we would expect. Though, if we are going live tomorrow, I do think it will be earlier. So watch out for around 7 p.m. UTC almost. Uh, until then, that's all for myself. Team. Bye. Bye. Thank, you. Thank you, people. Um, see you next time. Yeah. I think it's like 96. Sorry, what was that, John? I think this was Hortense of 96. I might be wrong. Is it Hortense of 96? I don't know. John, no. you're supposed to do better than this. What the hell is it? <laughs> it's Hortense. I'm not sure what year. It could be 96. Oh, God. You know what? Hey, I've never had to yeah. end on a face palm before, John, but I'm afraid. Yeah. Damn. Good night. I'm sorry, folks. Right. I'm not sure what it is, but I think it is 96 or 84, either or. Oh, um, my. Uh, it's, oh, it's Hortense of 84.
If you'd like to be part of Force 13's game shows, please send a message to Fool13 on Skype or send a message to my email address, force-13 at hotmail.co.uk. Uh, the game show starts on September 14th and will run through uh, October and finish at the beginning of November. So if you want to be part of the game show and test your storm knowledge, please let me know. <laughs>